Okay, so this is uh, HP M7 J120 DX. This 17 inch, the hinge is broken. This is where the fan. And it seems like many people have the same problem. And today, I'm gonna have to fix this one. To remove the battery, push it over. Yeah, we can see we have one, two, three, four, five. Just from the back here alone. Okay, this one, we just lift it up slowly. We need to remove the two screws. So under here, there's two, uh, one screw on this side, and one screw on the other side. But the other side is already broken, so it's already gone. So we need to remove the um, CD. So this is very easy. I don't know if we need to. There's three screws here. So the three screws on this side are small. These are small. This side here, there's one, two. There's one, two, and three. There are two screws here. I think this is the tiny one also. Yep, Those are these two are small ones. So I did a total of five small screws that I've seen so far. And here we have one. I always use the one with um, magnet so it's better. Here there's another screw here. So I show you have one, two, and three. Four here. All the ones that we can see here, just take them out. One, two, three. Oh, this oh. one over here is a long one. The hard drive. What we need to do is to pull this up and let it just so I just pull it out. And then we need to remove the cable over here. Here, okay, what you do? Take it out. And this one right here. Just pull it out. Connect it out. Under here, we have three screws, so that's why we need to take out the hard drive. So these three are also the shorter screws, small ones. Now you can unplug the battery. Okay, it will come out. So now I think we can lift it up very nicely. Yep, nothing else is in here. I'll just slide it out. All the screws out. Am I missing anything? Nope, that's it. Just pry it up and it should come out. So there are speakers in here that we need to remove. Okay, so we need to remove the speakers too. Anything else? Here. There's another speaker here. And this one. Okay. All right. This is all the stuff. Wow.
Okay, so all of these are broken. So we need to glue this one back. This side is also broken. I don't believe it. So I bought the Loctite Epoxy Instant Mix, one minute. And this one is like five bucks or four bucks or something. 2500 PSI. Okay, so I put a whole bunch of Loctite and wait for it to dry. Make sure it's straight. I screwed it in all the way down to make sure that it's tight and straight. And we put a screw in. It's kind of loose. 